Good evening, everyone. I'm Mrs. McFarlane, and I'm your child's grade 7 or grade 8 teacher this year. I'm thrilled to have that job, and I'm very disappointed that I can't be there tonight to say hi to everyone and welcome you back to another year here at Major B. Um, the reason why I'm not there is because um, I'm taking scuba diving lessons, and tonight is um, our final exam and our final practice dive in the pool. Um, so even as we speak, um, cross your fingers for me because I'm probably writing the exam right now. Um, I know Mr. Kirsten is playing this video for you and you're probably not in room 306 right now, but I invite you to go over there with your child and uh, take a look at their desk and my dog needs to go outside so I have to let him out. The best ways to keep in touch over the school year, um, we have quite a few options. You can always call the school, um, or you can sign up for our Remind 101 um, text message or email reminders. And a great way um, to keep in touch just with daily activities in our class is through our class blog. Um, I've made a brochure um, for you to take home tonight, and all of the information for signing up and instructions for signing up um, are located in that brochure. Oh, something new here at Major B, uh, we started towards the end of last year, um, is something called Homework Club. Um, so we have instituted this to help promote punctuality and reduce the number of lates that we have uh, coming in through the office. Um, so what that is, is after school, if your child is late, either in the morning or after second break, um, no matter how long they're late by, um, they spend a half an hour um, downstairs in Mr. McDonald's room catching up on the work that they missed in class. Um, myself, Mr. Kirsten, and Mr. McDonald, Mr. Ledbetter, and Mr. McKinnell um, will all be in there to help supervise during that time. The Pride program is also continuing this year at Major B. Again, all of the information that you might, you might need or questions that you might have might be answered with uh, that brochure that you're going to take home today. Um, so over the course of a month, uh, students are given lots of opportunities to earn pride points. You have to earn 10. And at the end of the month, there um, are special activities and sometimes trips. People who earn uh, 10 pride points are able to attend these events. Um, this month, I believe uh, we're using our new uh, sound system down in the gym to show a movie to the kids. Um, if you um, have indicated that you not want any photos uh, or video of your son or daughter put out onto the web. Respect that decision um, and understand that I'm going to beg you to reconsider. Um, the reason is uh, we do lots of activities here at Major B. Every week we show a slideshow um, at our Celebration Pride Assembly on Fridays. Um, we have a Major Blatch YouTube channel. Um, our Christmas concert is live streamed as well as our grade 8 graduation is live streamed. So there's lots of opportunities uh, for your child's success to be shown um, you know, on our blog, on our school blog, um, on that YouTube channel, and uh, through live streaming uh, of special events here at the school. Our homework policy um, in uh, our grade 7 8 classroom um, is pretty simple. Uh, anything that's not finished in class, um, then it is considered homework. I don't just assign you know, things for kids to take home for homework. Um, so if your son or daughter is using class time effectively um, and working hard and you know, diligently trying to get things done, chances are they're coming home and telling you that they don't have a lot of homework. They're telling you the truth. Um, I will be contacting you should someone start sliding and not handing things in. Um, I'm hoping that that doesn't have to happen. Um, but generally, uh, there shouldn't be a lot of things coming home if they're working well in class. As far as tests and quizzes go, I love a try uh, to give a week's notice um, before the test or quiz so that there's lots of time to prepare and it's not always uh, done at the last minute. So, thanks for coming tonight. Again, I'm sorry I can't be there to meet you in person. If you do want uh, to to me, just give me a call at the school and we can set up the time. Um, that works for both of us. Um, so, I'm getting ready for my school exam. Wish me luck.